and he saw twenty dollars, and he said, "No, I'm not going to start collecting money now. I'm so tired. I am going to, I am going to sleep, take a shower, and start the business tomorrow." Because on that side, he is, he has this false impression of America. America is a tough town. You need God in this place more than you need in Kenya. Praise the name of the Lord. You can be here 20 years, God forbid. If you be here 20 years, and when you go home, the people who want to go to the embassy, they ask for your bank statement because they think you have been in America and you have a lot of money. And you start telling them stories. You don't want to tell them. But the fact is, you don't have money. Praise the name of the Lord. Your word is a light, is a lamp unto my feet. To fail in school, if you're going to school, just don't study. You are guaranteed. I can bet a thousand dollars. Don't study. Don't do your homework. Don't do your assignments. I can bet a thousand dollars that you are going to fail. So if you are not, if you are not, uh, you, if you don't, if you forsake the discipline of reading the word of God, praying, I can guarantee you that you will start drifting away. The Bible is telling us in verse, in, in verse 1 of the book, pay more careful attention. Alright? So that we, what we have heard, we don't lose, we have not lost it. Praise the name of the Lord. So I give you two facts. What's fact number one? Drifting is an unconscious. Number two, it requires no effort. Number three, it always, it always ends in a shipwreck. You know what a shipwreck is? Shipwreck. What a train wreck.